वेलकम एवरी वन टू माई चैनल दैट इज़ फास्ट एंड ईजी मैथ विच इज़ डेडिकेटेड टू गिव यू टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स रिलेटेड टू मैथमेटिक्स सो स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू अ माइंड ब्लोइंग ट्रिक ओके टू फाइंड द टोटल नंबर ऑफ फैक्टर्स ऑफ एनी सेट ऑफ नंबर्स ओके एंड लॉट ऑफ टाइम्स इन दी एग्जाम्स दे आस्क यू वॉट आर द टोटल नंबर ऑफ ऑड फैक्टर्स फॉर अ गिवन नंबर और द टोटल नंबर ऑफ इवन फैक्टर्स फॉर अ गिवन नंबर देन इन दैट केस वॉट यू शुड बी डूइंग is you just have to follow this simple trick okay so before beginning with this big num- big numbers i will just start with a smaller number let's try to find total number of factors for 24 all you have to do is you have to do the factorization which is what 2 12 2 6 2 3 and 3 and 1 right so here i can say that we have how many 24 is equals to 2 raised to 3 into 3 raised to 1 correct so please understand in order to find the total number of factors total number of factors is nothing but raising the index by 1 for both so 3 in plus 1 which is what 4 into 1 plus 1 which is 2 so answer is 8 okay now in order to find the even factors what you have to do is you have to keep the index as it is for the even one which is 3 right and you raise the index for the odd one by 1 which is going to be 2 so 3 into 2 which will get you 6 and in order to find the odd factor all you have to do is we simply ignore the index for the even factor which is 2 and we will increase the index of the odd factor by 1 so here we get this as 2 okay but i'm sure you might be wondering for such big numbers how are we going to do these kind of factorization okay so you don't need to worry see i can write this as a thing but what then 105 into 100 right and 100 so we'll just first find out the factors of 105 which is what Uh, 5s are we get 2 and 1 so 3 7 7 and 1 and for 100 100 can be written as what 25 into 4 correct so here i can say 5 into 3 into 7 into 25 can be written as 5 square and 4 can be written as what 2 square right so final answer will be what 2 square So two square into three into five is one five and then five square. So we will add the index, which is five raised to three into seven. Okay. So what are the total factors? Total factors. I'll write down the answer over here. I will raise this index by one, which is what three. Here the index is one, so I'll increase it by one, so which will be what two. Here it is three. We'll increase it by one, which is four into. Seven is raised to one, so which is increased by one, so it's going to get you two. So this is going to be six into eight, that is going to be forty-eight. My answer is forty-eight. The total number of factors for one zero five double zero is forty-eight. Students, if you're liking the way I'm explaining, then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos. Okay, now. very quickly if i wanted to find the even factors even factors would have been what keeping the index of this as it is so this would be 2 into this will be 2 into 3 sorry into 4 into 2 so this is 4 into 4 16 into 2 which will get you 32 right similarly for odd we will have to do just increase all of these by 1 and in just ignore the two uh, power okay so this will be what for odd i can say it will be nothing but 2 into 4 into 2 so that would be 8 into 2 which is going to get you 16 okay no i know that they were not asking you to find even and odd but i just did it so that you get a clarity of how to do these kind of sums okay so now students don't forget at the end of this video i'm going to put up a diy question whose answer you can mention in the comment section okay so now see understand 147 can be written as what 
into 10 okay so this will be what this is directly going in 7 stable so we can write this as nothing but what 7 2 and 1 again 7 and 3 3 and 1 okay so my final answer will be what 7 square into 3 into 10 can be written as what 2 into 5 correct now for even factors we have to keep the index of even number as it is so which will be what 1 okay so final answer even factors will be 1 into increase all of these by 1 power increase all the powers by 1 so 2 plus 1 which will be getting 3 3 raised to 1 which will get increased by 1 so 2 5 raised to 1 will get increased by 1 which is getting 2 so 4 into 3 final answer is 12 okay so now time for this one so 296 please understand i can write 296 again and 0 so this can be written as what 296 i'm just going to find the factor of that and then 10 okay right 296 into 10 will get you 2960 right so now this will be getting you um let's say four uh, no we'll do two twos are i think this one will be a big one 14 and 8 148 so again two seven and four again two three and 37 now understand 37 is a prime number so after this you can't factorize this further so we have what 2 cube into 30 37 into 2 into 5 right 2 into 5 for the 10 one don't forget to uh, write the factors for 10 as well so final factors are what 2 raised to 4 into 5 into 37 so now finding the odd ones what is the factor for odd ones you keep you ignore the index of uh, the even factor so 2 raised to 4 will be completely ignored then to find the odd factors you increase both of their powers by 1 so 1 plus 1 will get you 2 into 1 plus 1 which will get you again 2 so final answer is 4 okay so this is the answer for this particular question okay now apart from this you sometimes come across something like this you know and you have to find the total number of factors so here what you should do is we take something which is common so i'm left with if i take 4 raised to 11 common so i'm left with 1 plus 4 plus 4 square plus 4 cube okay so this is 4 less to 11 1 plus 4 is 5 plus 16 plus 64 so this is going to get you 80 and this is going to get you 85 so i am getting 4 raised to 11 into 85 now i know 85 can be written as what 85 when taken from factors of 5 we'll have 7 so 5 into 17 so this can be written as 4 raised to 11 into 5 into 17 now in order to find the index total number of factors all you have to do is just raise the index by 1 so 12 into 2 into 2 so 12 into 2 is 24 into 2 final answer will be 48 you are getting 48 factors for this particular value of n okay so now time for your diy you will have to tell me what is the total number of factors please tell me okay don't tell me total tell me even factors even factors of uh, the number 2 um, 1 6 do let me know your answers in the comment section so that's it for today i will see you in the next video